The Beckley native returned to her hometown on Wednesday. Former First Lady Gail Manchin is federal co-chair of the Appalachian Regional Commission, which provides funding for various community and economic development projects in the area. Manchin's first stop was at the West Virginia Hive on South Canola Street. The Hive is the entrepreneurship program of the New River Gorge Regional Development Authority and provides advice and support to new and existing businesses in the area. Manchin says the purpose of her tour was to find out more about the projects that ARC Power Grants make possible. So these regional development programs are critically important across our state. I became aware of the fact that while I know West Virginia, I don't know about all of the projects and new projects that are going on in West Virginia. So I'm trying, I've also been trying to visit here in the state. But to come back to Beckley was just particularly important because I grew up here. And to know what Beckley was when I was growing up, and then as with many communities, sort of the downside of the community, and now with vision and leadership, how it's coming back. So uh, just I'm thrilled to be here. Next mansion joined Beckley Mayor Rob Rappold and other officials for a tour of the former Zins Cafe building in Neville Street. The city recently purchased the building and will lease it to Fruits of Labor, a culinary arts training center and cafe. We work to train individuals in recovery as well as at-risk youth as an addiction prevention program. They receive this encouragement and the community gets to take part in recovery efforts simply by coming in, sitting down, having a plate of food, buying a loaf of bread. It's so simple to be part of an active community that's changing the face of recovery because our students are investing in themselves, we're providing the safe space and the community is being welcomed in and they're welcoming our students into their community. Manchin also had lunch with representatives of Beckley at the historic Black Knight and she toured the Raleigh County Memorial Airport for a look at expansion efforts there. I'm Warren Ellison for News Talk, WWNR.